there are Barnet, Councillor Caroline Stock, and it's Love Parks Week. And I'd like to talk to you a little bit about our £5 million regeneration of the Silkstream Park and Montrose playing fields. This transformation was years in the making, but we finished it just as lockdown began, when everyone was being told to stay at home. But the good news is that COVID-19 restrictions have now been eased and we've seen lots of people enjoying everything there is in this beautiful and family friendly park, which it has so much to offer. We've created an amazing new wetland area in Silkstream Park that fills with water when the Silkstream Brook overflows, reducing the risk of flooding to nearby properties. And it's become a real haven for local wildlife, particularly birds, and there's um, a broad walk across it so you can enjoy the space with them. And there's also a great, a fantastic new playground in Silkstream Park with um, a climbing frame, a slide, seesaw, which I love, uh, swings, roundabout and more. You can also find new benches, uh, picnic tables, which is really nice in this weather, and scenic winding pathways in the park. So it's really a great place to go and visit. Just across the road you've got Montrose playing fields and we've created a pedestrian crossing to slow down the cars to make it safe and easy to cross between the two parks. When you go into Montrose the first thing you might see is our new skate park which is really very impressive and very popular now. Next to that you can see Unitas. This is Barnet's youth zone and it really is incredible and there's so many attractions for young people including a gym, a sports hall, music studio, um, there's a climbing wall, an incredible climbing wall, I'm very impressed with that, and a rooftop 3G all weather football pitch and there's so much more and you can even have um, a meal there. We put 4.2 million into its construction while charitable donations towards on-site youth zones who also pay for its upkeep made up the rest of the 6.5 million building costs. We've created a new active zone on the other side of Unitas, which includes two tennis courts, table tennis ta uh, tables, um, a basketball court, outdoor gym and park hall area. And it's great to see so many people using it now. The allotments are still there and we've also introduced a new play a playground for Montrose playing fields. There's a new building next to the playground called The Hub and it contains a cafe, changing rooms, public toilets and a multi-use area for activities such as um, small um, events or workshops. Unfortunately we've had to delay opening it due to COVID-19 but keep an eye on it because um, social media will tell you whether there's further updates about its opening. I'd like to thank the Mayor of London, the Environment Agency and the London Marathon Trust for their contribution towards this amazing huge regeneration project. I've told you quite a lot about Silkstream and Montrose today, but perhaps the best thing about these parks is that they can be enjoyed by people of all ages and backgrounds, and there really is something for everyone. You can enjoy a peaceful stroll, you can play sports or work out with your friends or enjoy some family time in the playgrounds. We really wanted these parks to be a special place where the whole community can come together, because together we are Barnet.